I guess to begin with, I've been doing my Zoom classes in my room. Um, both of my parents are home working as much as they can, so um, it's easier if I just stay in my room, but the Wi-Fi connection isn't the best in here. So um, I did today go out into my dining room and like two minutes before class ended, my Wi-Fi completely cut out and I texted someone in the class. I was like, what did she just say? Cause they're about to say like when the exam was. Oh, luckily I only missed like two minutes of the class, so. Um, my Zoom classes I take in my bedroom. Uh, it's just, it provides a little bit more privacy. Um, and that way I don't have to worry about dogs running in and out of frame <laughs> or barking. <laughs> um, and then I do my homework mostly here in the living room. But if I'm working on stuff late at night, I tend to go up into my room and work on it because that way I don't have to come back upstairs when I'm done. <laughs> um, most of it is actually right here. I'm sitting at my desk right now. I have my books behind me. Um, so most of it happens here. If my internet goes down, I go back downstairs where uh, it can reach me better. So this is where I do all of my studying. Sometimes I have my classes here on my bed. Um, other times I'm sitting here at my desk. You can see I've got some stuff going on right now. And then I keep my books here on this shelf. Or if I need to, I've had some overflow. So they also hang out right there. Uh, my favorite thing about doing stuff on Zoom and working at home is I think that I'm actually, I think I'm so worried about being not being able to keep on track I guess with work that I am way ahead in everything right now so that's kind of nice and um a lot of times I kind of procrastinate until the last minute but here I'll be kind of bored and I'll be like well how about I just do this homework assignment a couple days early instead of waiting until two hours before it's due so um that's been kind of nice sleeping in <laughs> definitely um my classes are doing a combination of Zoom classes and asynchronous classes. And my earlier classes are the ones that are asynchronous. So I actually get to sleep in and it's fantastic. Uh, I like having classes this way um, because I get to see my family a lot more. I get to spend time with them and uh, kind of get to do homework according to my schedule a little bit extra. Um, but I also like the fact that Zoom has those breakout rooms uh, where you can still have that small group discussion and still feel like you're in a classroom, um, even though like everybody's right there, but then you can have um, smaller groups as well. Uh, my least favorite thing is definitely sometimes um, I'll be in the middle of a lecture and the professor, I have no idea what she's saying because my Wi-Fi is cutting out and it's glitching really bad. Um, so that's not ideal, um, and I do really miss all of my friends and everybody at Bluffton, so I'm um, not being able to ha go to those campus events and um, do all the fun things planned for the end of the semester, that's kind of not my favorite. <laughs> um, because I'm home, I don't always want to actually do my homework, so I'd rather spend time with my family, and so it makes it challenging to actually have the motivation to do my schoolwork. <laughs> uh, my least favorite would probably be not getting to see everybody. Uh, it is my senior year and so I'm kind of feeling that loss of everything that comes with being a senior. Um, so I miss out on those connections with the friends and getting to do the things for the last time. And so that's been kind of my struggle. It's been a hard pill to swallow that, you know, it just kind of abruptly ended and that was my senior year. Um, so yeah, that's probably been the thing I don't like about having to do Zoom. Uh, at first, I was kind of nervous and I was very emotional. I couldn't decide if I wanted to go home or stay when we first got that um, initial email, but um, I decided to stay. <laughs> um, but then as soon as we were told we could leave, I was like, okay, I wanna leave right now. I was like, I was already on the fence, like I'm ready. Um, I always did have to wait to go home um, until our floors were gone. But um, 
it wasn't too bad. I still got to leave earlier than um, a lot of the other RAs. Um, and since I've been home, I think I'm just happy that I'm like with my family and stuff. Um, I know not everybody is in like a comfortable space and stuff. So um, I'm really lucky to um, have my family, I guess, <laughs> my parents, I don't know. Yeah, so some of the feelings I've been uh, having are um, anxiety, for sure. Uh, Zoom was pretty foreign to me at first, so I wasn't sure what I was doing. Um, and it was just kind of sprung on us, like, all right, we're doing Zoom classes. And so it was trial by fire. Luckily, it went really well, and I'm thankful for that. I know the IT and the Bluffton staff did a really good job with all that, making sure it was smooth. Um, so that helped a lot. Um, I'm also kind of nervous about the future now. Uh, I am a senior, and so this this is it. And so once May rolls around, I'll be looking for a full-time job. I am now. Um, but kind of having that uncertainty of like, all right, these are the steps you've gone through as a senior, um, but that's not there for me. So it's just kind of like, go find a job now, you know? And so that's been a little um, nerve wracking too. Um, but like I said before, I do have all this time with my family now, and so that's been really encouraging, um, having them there to be kind of that support and that backup and um, kind of just encourage me along the way.